What's going on guys, Bills here from Achievement Land and I'm here with an Achievement Walkthrough for Kick It Bunny. This game just got updated to 2000 Gamer Score. They added 13 new achievements and I'm going to show you how to unlock them. There's an achievement for going around and finding all the color chests. There's 14 of them. I'm going to show you where they all are. I'm going to show you the map. It shows them on the map after you collect them. And I'm going to go up to each one and show you how to get to it. There's a secret color one that's hidden in the waterfall. I'll show you where this is as well. There's a square ring that we have to jump through. It's all the way at the top of the map by the white color chest. So I'll show you where this is. You have to jump through it. Then wet jump, you have to jump down the waterfall. So I'm going to show you how to do this. It's the waterfall that's right behind you at the start. We have to kick the hat man. He's over at the top left. I'll show you where this is. You just have to go over and kick him. Very easy. We have to kick 20 chickens. There's chickens right by the start. You just have to go around there and just keep kicking until this pops. The good thing is the tracker works for these uh, achievements too. You have to kick somebody off the deck chair 30 times and also 10 times for two achievements. So the hippos that are over by the soccer ball in the water, they keep going on the chair. You can just keep kicking them off and then they'll come over and they'll kick you. You have to get kicked by animals 30 times and 10 times for an achievement as well. When I loaded up the game, the achievement for getting kicked by an animal 10 times popped retroactively as soon as I started. We have to kick somebody off the deck chair 10 times. You also have to play soccer and score 5 and 10 goals. For some reason, these were very delayed for me and it popped the 10 one first. There's two different soccer areas. There's the one in the water and there's the one by the chickens right by you. I believe they both work, but I did the one by the chickens. You get an achievement for using any of the color chests. We have to use all 14. Once you find it, you have to kick it and use it. It will change your color and the achievement for getting kicked by the animals 10 times. This is the one that should pop as you load up the game. So this is the starting point of the game. You can hit start and hit SOS at any time and it'll bring you back here. This is the map. If you press Y, you can bring up the map. All those little squares, there's 14 of them. Those are the chest. So later on, I'm gonna walk up to each one and show you where exactly they are and how to get to them. Most of them are easy. There's a few that are a little tricky. So here at the starting area, we could do a few things. We have the waterfall behind us. We have the chickens nearby and the soccer ball net. Also straight over this way, the hippos are lounging so you can keep kicking them off the chair. Now right behind us, there's two waterfalls. There's one down here, there's the little one. And this is where the secret chest is hidden. So you want to go down here carefully. And you want to kick this chest. This is the rainbow chest. We're going to get two achievements, one for using any of the color chests. And then also we're going to get the achievement for finding the secret one. So that's one of the 14 chests. It will show up on the map now that we found it. We're going to go around and get the other 13 after. Now over here is the soccer net and also the little chickens. You have to kick chickens 20 times. So just keep kicking these chickens over and over again until the achievement pops. There we go. And like I said, the trackers work, so you can uh, keep them open if you want. Now, while we're here, we can play soccer. You have to score 5 and 10 goals. So just keep kicking in the soccer ball. I have the trackers open. For some reason, uh, these achievements were a little delayed for me. Football or 2, like, stopped tracking at one point, And football or 3 just kept tracking. And then 3 popped before 2 on my main account. This is my dummy account. They actually uh, popped okay. See, I scored, I'm at six, and the, the fifth one should have popped already. So, they're just a little delayed. Don't worry, they'll pop eventually. But yeah, you have to score five, and you have to score ten. So just keep putting in the ball till you have ten, and you should unlock both achievements. There's another soccer ball area, too. The one by the hippos, there's soccer in the water. It's a bigger ball and a bigger net. I believe you could do it on that one as well. This one's a lot closer, and it's a lot smaller, so it might be easier to just do it here. Alright, there we go. Now we have to jump down the waterfall, the big one behind us, for an achievement. It was kind of weird to get this one to pop. I fell, like, through the waterfall and came down. And that's what actually made it pop, finally. So you just have to walk up the left side and go around and go to the top. 
and then jump down and the achievement should pop. There we go. All right, so we need to kick animals off the lounge chair and also get kicked by animals. We're gonna go over this way. This is where the lounge chairs are. There's a few around in other places, but this is a good spot. These hippos keep sitting on the lounge chairs. So you kick them off, they'll go flying away. And you have to do that 30 times. And you have to get kicked by them 30 times. So they're gonna come back and kick you and then go back on the lounge chair. And you could just stay here, do it over and over again. Sometimes you'll see more hippos come and join and go on the chairs as well. But after you do it for a while and do it 30 times, you'll get the achievement. And you'll also get the achievement for getting kicked 30 times. So after you're done, pause the game and hit SOS and we'll go back to the beginning. We're going to go over to the blue square on the map. We're going to go and get all the chests now. For this one, you have to climb up the rocks here. And then once you get up here, you want to kick it. And that will change your color. And that's going to be chest number two. We're going to head down to the next chest, which is the green one. We're going to go around the map and as we go around, we'll get the square ring and the hat man as well. So this one's easy to get. It's right here. You just have to go up the ramp the way you'd go up to go to the waterfall and then just walk back here. Now we're going to go down to the yellow one. You could just walk to the edge of the mountain up here by the green and we can jump off and we could swim over to it. You want to go around to this side. There's like a ramp area we can go up right here and then kick it and there we go. Now press pause and go to SOS and that will bring us back to the main area. And now we're going to go to the left and get the one over here. You have to climb up. This can be a little tricky. Just go back and forth and you can jump a little bit. If you go up the right path, the right way, you should be able to get up. There we go. And here's the chest. We're going to kick it. And now you can see the next chest, which is straight ahead over that way. The gray one. So over here, it's right under the bridge. So go over here and kick it. Now we can go to the next one. We're gonna go up and to the left a little bit to the black one. So just go up the ramp. It's easy to get up here. And then here's the black one. Now we can jump down to the next one very easily. That's why we went to the black first. We're gonna jump down to the pink one. You're overlooking it up here. So we'll jump down. And here's the pink one. And now you're gonna swim all the way to the bottom left area, to the blue one. So just swim all the way around. It's pretty fast and easy to get over here. And then the blue one's on this little island. And now you're gonna swim up to the top left area, go up into this area, and we'll see a red one. It's over by the racetrack. Now up in the top left area is where the hat man is. You can see my cursor up here. You just have to walk up this ramp, and as you go up the ramp, you'll see him right over here on the right side. You have to kick him for the achievement. Every time you kick him, it gives you a hat. There we go, we got the achievement. And to the left of the hat man is the yellow chest. So you can jump off the side towards it. It's right over here. This one could be a little tricky. It's not too bad though. You want to run with L trigger and jump. And then just walk around here. And there we go. Now head to the right. We're going to go to the top middle area where the white chest is. This is also where the square ring is. The chest is very easy to get to. So just come over here and kick it. And now if you look up and to the right, you'll see the square ring in the sky over the tree. You have to walk up this ramp over here. It's a little bit of a weird angle, but we need to jump through it. You can kind of land on the tree a bit, but not on the back side or you'll fall through. There we go. And once you go through it, you'll get the achievement. All right, we can continue on. We only have two chests left. We're gonna go to the right, the top right area. There's a lime green one over here. It's pretty easy to get, but you have to go around the back. 
and it's sitting on the floor it's very easy to get and from this one we're going to go to the next one the purple so just walk this path all the way down here where i am and then we can climb up you want to follow this island path over here and just keep walking up the grass we're getting closer and there it is this is the last chest that we need so once you get them all you're gonna get the achievement and that's gonna be your last achievement and you'll be done with this game so that's it guys that's how you get all the achievements with the update Thanks so much for watching. I hope this video helped you. Leave a like if it did, and I'll catch you guys next time here at Achievement Land. <laughs>